Good morning. Um, what a beautiful day. Um, the sun's out, a few clouds in the sky, no wind. Um, I'm going to hit that beach at the back of me. You can see in the background Appledore. Um, this is uh, Insto. Um, tide's slowly going out. Um, so I'll be hitting the uh, low tide mark today, um, looking for pre decimals and so forth. So I'll see you on the first one. First target of the day, reading 67, and it's this coin here. It's got to be a 2p. Let me just give that a swill. Yep, yeah, 2p. Right, on to the next one. Water's nice and calm. Not even a ripple coming onto the beach. But what a beautiful day. So I'm going to be heading in between those boats up there. Uh, see what I can pick up. Um, I want to do uh, a thank you to Liam from History Revisited. Um, he gave me a good shout out yesterday on one of his digs. Much appreciated. Thank you for that, Liam. Right, I'll see you on the next one. Just dug this out, reading a 42, and it's an old, uh, I say it's an old razor. Let's give it a swill. Yeah, I used to put the old blades in them. Plastic down the bottom, but metal up the top. On a beach. <laughs> Right, on to the next one. <laughs> this was measuring 46, and it's this item here. It's got to be a penny. Oh, it's 20p. Let's give it a wash. Yeah, 20p. Happy with that. Right, let's move on. Reading a 48, and it's that item there. Which could be a coin, it could be anything. Looks like a coin, but I'll clean all that off when I get back. Last time I had two off here, they were sixpences, so that's about the same size as a sixpence, I think. And again, it could be a button, I don't know. I'll clean that up when I get back. This was reading 34, and I think it could be some sort of seal. Not too sure, but I reckon that could be a seal. Some description. I'll give that a clean when I get back as well. Right, on to the next. This is reading 23, and it's a coin. Don't know what sort it is. Probably a penny. It's been down there a long time. You can see all the green on it. But I'll give that a clean when I get back as well. Wind's picking up and uh, didn't bring me my car today, so sorry about that. Right, let's move on. Reading a 52, I think it's going to be a show, showcase. Somewhere there. there it is, I can see it. Showcase. There it is. Right, let's move on. Another reading of 52. Guarantee it's going to be a showcase. Straight on it. There it is. No. Let's get it out. Let me 
fingers there it is yeah another showcase I won't uh, show you any more of these if I find any more because there's part of a bitcher one at the moment it's full of them right let's move on just had me lunch <clears throat> just watching all the uh, people walking by with the dogs um, they was trying to ban the dogs off this beach because uh, some owners just let them do what they want and mess all over the place but uh, saying that 99% of them are responsible uh, when they've got their dogs with them <clears throat> yeah turned out and warm winds dropped again um, I didn't think it would be get any wind today but uh, yeah found a few more shell cases which are obviously I didn't show any shown the first two but uh, I'm just gonna go on the dry sand now see what I can pick up from there right see ya gonna see you on the next one this came up at uh, a reading a 90 and I know exactly what it is it's a shell case um, when that's uh, all that mucks off it, they come up beautiful I've uh, got a couple at home so I should take that back and give it a good clean and polish it up wind's picked up right on to the next one another showcase reading 95 chuff oh. with that so that's a, another pair I've got but they do come up really nice solid brass lovely put those in the uh, machine when I get back get all the muck off it right on to the next one well that's me finished on the beach uh, too many people on there now dogs running about all over the place um, no uh, so I stopped I'm going to head home and I'll uh, put up my fines later. Take care. Well, back from the uh, beach dig. Got my coffee there. Just good through the fines. Uh, 20 pence piece. Um, that coin, I reckon, could be uh, sixpence. Um, I found a couple last time, so I'm going to just give that a gentle clean, see what, how it comes up. It's either sixpence or a penny. Um, 2p. Don't know what's underneath that one but it's been down there a long long time could be a button actually looking at it now with a dent in the center um, one seal bit of a pattern on there or something on there um, razor I can't believe that when I pull that out. It's an old type or what? Um, bit of junk down the bottom, copper, rivet thing. Plenty of shell cases. Um, that's the larger one of the smaller, the smaller ones. Um, these two items here, which are an exact sam sample of the one I've got here and all that stuff will come off and then it will look like that and all you got to do is polish it up solid brass um, yeah so that's what them two will look like when cleaned up so that's be fine for today and i'll see you on the next one